When I, when I was frisky, over some potent whiskey. Come on, mister. Keep your eyes open. This must have happened recently. Hey, come have a look at this. Sure, I'm just moving real slow. Suit and tie. One bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Well, good. I've already yeah, killed a bunch of them. Run into them. <laughs> Let's see if we've got any identification. Okay. We should get going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. No, you won't. Trash begets trash, my Uncle Reginald used to say. Reginald was a wise man. Let me tell you. Town preacher and town sheriff. They're right again here. A drink a sailor under the table before breakfast. He had one tiny hand, like a child's, on the end of a grown man's arm. But anyway, this tells the you what kind of people the Braithwaites are. Selling moonshine to murderers. See? What did I tell you, boys? What did I say? I said this place was crawling with vermin. And we just found ourselves the rat's nest par excellence, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back in 78. Oh, well, shut the way up. Actually, let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. Let's split up. Arthur and Bill, me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? We'll take the left. Let's stop these filthy, degenerate tax dodgers. The cheek of them. A fine idea. Us. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out and then tie them up. Got it. works. Oh, they did kill- they did knock out some people. Okay. What a coincidence. There's four of us and there happen to be four of them to take out. Good work, gentlemen. I think that's it. Well, what do we do now? We better destroy all this. Any of your boys can handle explosives? Sure. Anyone but him. Oh, so. Don't you? Tell me about <laughs> that. Is the last time I'll mention it, I swear. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. We'll put two, just in case.
Oh, it's going. It's going. In a minute. Sometimes they got good stuff. All right. I'll see you over there. <laughs> I'm tired of you robbing bodies. Thanks, Daddy Dutch. Well, forgive me, but me and my men must return to our lives. Ah, seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it for personal consumption. It's sort of part of the job. <laughs> but I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. But my cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Only I didn't, quiet. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Finally. You've always been a Finally. piece of crap. Come on, move it. We have a life on a land so stupid, a backwater so backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on. <laughs> you ride with me. Okay. Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always? From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. That was worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. It's a turtle. These lawmen, these two families. I mean, I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the young Dutch again. What do you mean, young Dutch? I'm as strong as I have ever been. My hey, horse you know is way bigger than Why his don't horse. I race you back. Okay, you're on. That's the spirit. Okay, on my word. Set, go. Yep. <laughs> yeah, let's just dope the horse for the race. Turkey tried to kill me. I 
I never knew you were quite so good at running away, Arthur. Well, I never knew age had slowed you down quite so much. <laughs> well, time is a bastard. When you get to be my age, well, you'll know that better than anything. Be well. I had fun with you today. You're... I was gonna say you're like a son to me. But you're more than that. Oh, that hurts. Hey, we're back. Okay, so... We got two story missions in the camp no real um, side missions so we got Bill let's <laughs> gonna go say let's go do Abigail what did you just say hey Arthur what's going on Jose and John are looking for you. They went out to the moonshine stash, said you knew where that was. They was planning a visit to the Braithwaite place, but John needs to do something for Dutch now, so Hosea wants you to join him instead. Seems to be a lot going on. You're telling me. Okay, thank you. Not the bell. I'm sorry. Wow, that was it? Thanks, Abigail, for playing the messenger. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like Shot to him this? back to Gamora. Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. Wow. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Well, hit the goddamn bank with us. <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. Ain't it for serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> All right, I suppose it's worth taking a look at least. We should wait until the morning. In any case, I need to change out of these rags if I'm going to be performing. Okay. What the hell's wrong with his hair? It's better be worth it. Oh, it is. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. 